Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Encrypted and welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having yourselves an amazing day. And in today's video, we are going to be continuing with the Survival Island Let's Play here on part 6. And uh, what I'm hoping for with this episode is I'm hoping we can get enough Ender Pearls to just open the end portal, go to the end, fight the dragon, and get it all done with. I'm hoping we can get enough Ender Pearls this episode. I doubt we'll fight the dragon this episode, but hopefully we can at least get the portal open this episode. And then next episode we'll probably fight the dragon if I can get the portal open. Uh, however though, I am trying to talk fast because it is nighttime, and that is exactly what we need to go hunt down some Endermen. So what we're going to do is we are going to jump in this boat, and we're just going to go to the other islands, and we're going to check them out, scope them out a little bit, see if we can find any Endermen. Probably going to start with that one. And uh, my Xbox is currently revving up like crazy. I apologize for that. It is a very annoying Xbox. I really just want to throw it out the window sometimes. <laughs> Seriously. But anyways, yeah, we're going to this island. Hopefully we'll find some Ender Pearls. And uh, yeah, I'll be there in just a second. Oh my god, I got hit with mining fatigue. Okay, this Xbox needs to chill, bro. Just chill, Xbox. Chill. What are you doing that's so difficult? I'm not even looking at anything that's not already rendered. Maybe my Xbox has mining fatigue. I don't know. Okay, I don't see any Endermen anywhere. But I do see some new islands, which is pretty dope. But not really what we want. We want some freaking Endermen, bruh. Bruh. Actually, I don't see any... Oh, wow. I spoke too soon. I do see mobs. I do see mobs. I hate these guys. I actually hate these guys in this new update. I hate them. Like, they're so annoying. It's like, quit spawning on me. We're gonna have to be quick because nighttime is not gonna last forever. Obviously. So let's, let's see which island should I go to next. Oh god, that's a big freaking island. Is that even an island? Is that mainland? That might be mainland. Huh. This boat isn't turning where I want it to. Oh, well, I'm finding just about every mob other than Endermen, which is eh, pretty average if I'm being honest. Oh crap, I heard phantoms. What the hell's killing me? What is killing me? Oh, you skeleton, are you kidding me? Oh my god, get out of here. You suck. Oh my god, I'm not in the mood to deal with that right now. Well, bad news is we did not find any Endermen, which can't say I'm really surprised at. I was, okay, Phantom, really. Can't say I'm really surprised that I didn't find any Endermen. I would have been really shocked if we did. Um, they're pretty rare. They are pretty rare for sure. Um, which is fine though. I don't, you know, it's whatever. We actually do have three Ender Pearls right now, and obviously we have enough Blaze Powder from last episode. Screw off! So thanks to all those things we do have, we can potentially still find the End Portal this episode without the Ender Pearls. We might be able to do it. Uh, so I think I am gonna try to do that. Um, you know, my Xbox is really pissing me off right now. Like, just shut up, Xbox. What is your problem? Okay, uh, where are my Ender Pearls? Here they are. Nice. Okay, we are going to go ahead and craft the Eye of Enders. Wait a minute. Oh, what? You only get three? Oh, I thought... What? Is that... Is that right? I, maybe, maybe I'm just thinking something else. I could have sworn that... I could have sworn that one blaze powder and one ender pearl somehow creates two eyes. I, I could be wrong on that. Yeah, I'm probably wrong on that. Anyways, we have our ender ender eyes. <laughs> Nonetheless, we do have our ender eyes, which is awesome. So I guess we're gonna go hunt down the end portal. Yeah. And am I am I really about to get attacked by phantoms still? What is this? Did you hear that? I heard a phantom. I'm not crazy. I definitely heard one. Anyways. 
I'm going to plant this stuff down real quick because we are going to need it. Alright, so I will say this now. Um, hopefully we do find the end portal because... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> you have to be kidding me. Are you serious right now? You freaking idiot. Look at, look at him. That's cool. He has like some kind of effect on his wings. You know, I've never seen this before. I didn't even know they could actually find a way in there. Huh. Can I get in with it? Oh, it's killing me. But Yeah, I, I can actually ride with this thing. Alright, bud, let's go. <laughs> That's hilarious. Wait, is he still in here? Yeah, he's still in here. <laughs> is he going to keep killing me? or <laughs> Is he friendly now? No, he's not. He's definitely not friendly, but... That's hilarious. I'm like low-key tempted to keep him here. You know what? I think I will. Only downside is I do need to make my own new boat, but it is totally worth it. I welcome my new family member with open arms. Anyways, uh, we probably are going to have to go to mainland just because... Oh, don't want to go on that. Don't want to go on that. Yeah, we probably are going to have to go to the mainland just because I feel like that is where the portal is going to be located, which... I'm sure you probably already anticipated that, which isn't a big deal at all. Um, you know, I already said in the second episode that I think I will probably go to the mainland a decent amount, just because you know, I kind of have to. So here's what we're going to do. All right. If we throw this eye of Ender, it's going to take us in the direction towards the portal. The only downside is the pearl, the eye, might get destroyed. So, I mean, it's just a risk we're going to have to take. We literally have no other option besides going around randomly digging, which, yeah, that's not happening. So, let's go. Oh, it's going that way. Okay, don't break, don't break. Yes, awesome. Okay, so I think I think this is the way it wanted me to go. I think pretty much the way I'm going right now. Um, however, I don't know when I feel like I should throw the next pearl. I guess I'll throw the next... Well, not Pearl, the next eye. I'm going to throw the next eye probably when we get to mainland. Because I really doubt that it's not going to be on mainland. Like, I just I just don't think they do do that. So, anyways, I will cut back to when we get to the mainland. Oh, I think we found it, boys. Oh, yes. What is this, a taiga? This is either a taiga or a spruce forest. Okay, I I think we might have veered off a little bit on the course we were supposed to go on to get to where the eye was heading towards, but I think we're pretty much in the right area. So once we get on this mainland, I am going to toss another eye. Now if it goes backwards, then... Well, if it goes backwards, I guess that's good too, actually, because that means we've passed it and we can probably find it easier. Alright, I think I'm going to throw the eye right here, just so we know for sure if we're heading the right way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it wants us to go this way. Don't break. Don't break. Yes. Okay, we're going to keep going this way then. Um, yeah. I really don't know when I should throw another freaking eye, because I don't want to risk breaking it. Because we only got three, and we don't even have anywhere near, near enough to uh, open the portal, so I don't want to lose any. All right. I think we found a planes. Yeah, we found a planes biome. Nice. Alright, so maybe I should try throwing another eye. I don't know. Oh, I really don't want to, because I feel like it's going to break. There's no way it's not going to break. You know what? We need to, though, because if, if we passed it, we need to know. We need to know now if we passed it. So, I think this is the direction we've been going in, so let's just throw it right... Actually, let's, let's just throw it straight up. Oh, wow, it still wants us to go this way. Yes! Oh my god, that's lucky. I think it's like a 50-50 chance, by the way, for these eyes to break whenever you throw them. So the fact that we've gotten them back all three times so far, pretty lucky. Oh, nice! There's a pumpkin over here. Awesome, there's one pumpkin, that's perfect. Oh wait, actually, there's pumpkins over here, I'll grab these. Yeah, we need pumpkins, we need just one pumpkin just because I need to make a, uh... I need to make one of those masks. I need to make like a pumpkin mask because if you wear that whenever you're in the end, uh, the Endermen cannot see your eyes, which means they will never get aggroed at you. Okay, well, I am tempted to throw another eye, but I feel like we're nowhere close yet. So, I don't know. I really, oh, I don't feel like throwing the eye right now. Oh, look at all this. I think, is this like a... Is this a flower forest? Is this what this is? 
This is really pretty. I'm actually going to collect some of these. Here, I'm going to collect one of each just because. All right, well, never thought I was going to say this, but good news is it's actually getting dark. So maybe we might find some Endermen on the way through here. Oh, crap. I just remembered, though. We're going to have to deal with Phantoms. Dang it. Oh, I didn't sleep. Yeah, we're going to be screwed if we start getting ambushed by Phantoms. We're going to be really screwed. In fact, you know what? Let's just... Let, let's just throw an eye because like oh wow there's a roof forest over there okay let's throw the eye let's just throw it right here oh yes we passed it guys we passed it oh my god we passed it okay so that means we were above it at one point we were literally right above it at one point but where where the hell could it have been usually in the bedrock edition here's a tip for you if you didn't know uh, usually in the Bedrock Edition, whenever you're at a village... Yeah, I'm getting screwed over by phantoms right now. Um, oh, wow. Oh, boy. This isn't good. I'm trying to freaking get my pro tip out. Leave me alone. Anyways, if you're above a village and you're looking for the end portal, um, if the eye looks like it's heading towards the village, just try digging into the village, like, under it. Because a lot of the times, at least in the Bedrock Edition... Uh, the stronghold spawns most often underneath the village, which sadly in this case it did not because, you know, I didn't see any village. That <laughs> sucker. Yeah, that's right. Alright, I don't know really where this freaking thing could be. Enderman! Enderman! No, it's raining! He's getting freaking screwed over. Oh my god, he's getting decimated by this rain right now. Which sucks because, like, he's not going to stand still long enough for me to catch him. You know, it's like everything that could be going wrong right now is just going wrong. We find an Enderman, but he's getting screwed over by the dumbass weather in this game. I was hoping maybe he'd like go under a tree or... Get off me! Seriously? Okay, this isn't good. It really sucks though, I was hoping I could could have gotten that Enderman. I wonder where they go whenever they get screwed over by rain like that? Like, do they just stay in the overworld and just continuously take damage until they die? Or do they, like, just disappear finally and get the hint? <laughs> Wait a minute! Oh, <gasps> Wasn't this where we threw the pearl the last time? Or threw the eye? Isn't this right where we threw it the last time? Because if so, that means we pass it again. <gasps> yeah! Yeah, I think we did throw the pearl here. Okay, so we definitely... It should be under this plains biome somewhere. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to get to the center. Now it stops raining! Now it stops raining! Really? Really, after you throw the Enderman out, then you stop raining. And I'm still getting attacked by phantoms. Enderman! Oh! Wait, is he... He's f***ed me! What did I do? What did I do? Don't get me wrong, I want to kill you and all, but damn. Just wait. Why is he f***ed me? What did I do to him? I didn't even look at him. Oh! Oh, yes! Oh my god, yes! Finally, something goes my way. Oh, we got it! Yes, we got an Ender Pearl! Yes! I'll just throw it. Okay, so it's going this way. Oh, Enderman! Hey! Enderman, get over here! No, 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 no. Don't leave! Oh, he's pissed. Okay, he's pissed. Sorry, I'm like... I'm like low-key in a toxic mood this episode because of that. That's why I'm in a toxic mood this episode because of that. Why would he spawn right here? Um, I guess I'll just drop down and kill him. Really? <laughs> oh! <pfft. laughs> Serves you right, idiot. My mind is like all over the place right now. Okay, so the Eye of Ender wanted us to go this way again, so we're definitely close. We're like really pinching into the area right now where it should be. All right, we literally just came from here. And the the eye told us to come this way, and we threw it just a little ways over there. So I mean, like if it tells us to go backwards, then I'm going to start digging probably right there if it tells us to go back. Now, if it tells us to keep going forward, um I'll probably just dig right in the middle. Here right here is probably a great spot to throw it. <laughs> I think this is it. I think this is it right here, actually. I'm not even joking. I think right here is where we need to start digging. Did you see how, like, fast it, like, stopped moving? 
Like, it didn't really go out very far, did it? So that kind of tells me that... Kind of tells me we need to start digging right here. So we're just going to dig right here. And if it isn't right here, then hopefully we'll dig into, like, a cave system or something. You know, that, like, leads us to it. So, yeah, I guess I'm going to start digging, and I will be back shortly. Oh. Okay, we did dig into... Into a cave here. Alright, I guess we're just gonna jump down. Oh, wow! Oh, mine shaft! Mine shaft. That's good. I've noticed recently that every stronghold I've been finding has a mine shaft in it. So the fact that we just found a mine shaft is probably a very good sign. Probably means we are in the right. <laughs> wow. That. That, that is just, that's terrific. Honestly, that just, like, that just made my mood go from f***ing crap to just absolutely amazing. Look at that. <laughs> well, guess who could make a diamond sword now? <laughs> this guy. Oh, wow. Scratch that. Guess who can make a diamond sword and an enchanting table? Freaking A, dude. Let's go. We're good. Four diamonds. We have five, technically. I have one extra at home. This is great. This is, this is just, this is awesome. I mean, honestly, I'm freaking elated over that. Thank you, game. Thank you, game, for taking a break from sh down my neck to giving me a minute to just be happy. I appreciate it. All right, now we just got to find this stronghold, which hopefully will be... Oh! <laughs> game, I f***ing love you right now. Like, I actually love this game right now. Zombie, don't ruin this moment. Get out of here. Okay, um... Well, I guess we're just gonna... I guess we're just gonna dig into it. Actually, hold on, we could... We'll go up through there. Wait a minute, did I just hear a cave spider? Oh, pff, perfect. Thanks, game. Okay. Oh, look at that! Oh, wow. Okay, on a serious note, this looks pretty... This looks weird. Look at this. It's it's so glitched. There's something up right now with Bedrock Edition where it cannot help itself but to spawn the stronghold in a freaking mineshaft every time. Wait, what? <gasps> Fortune 1? Oh, hold on a minute. Yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, we're going to need that. We are going to need that. Oh, yeah. A hundred percent. I like what you're throwing at me, game. I like this. You should do this more often. This game is being so freaking awesome right now. Like, I'm not even joking. Like, this game is awesome right now. Okay. Let's... Let's explore this thing. Now, the good news is... If we are very, 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 very lucky, which... I mean, don't get me wrong. We've been lucky so far in the past five minutes. But, I'm talking, like, extremely lucky. Like, if we get extremely lucky, we may find enough Ender Pearls from chests around here. Maybe. There's a very slim chance of that. And to be fair, I don't know if I want that. Because I don't really want to go to the end right now. I want to do it... I'll do it in this episode, maybe. But I do want to head back to Spawn Island first to make an enchanting table... Enchant the sword or the pickaxe, not sure of which, and actually, yeah, that's about it. I, I just want to enchant my stuff real quick. This is kind of creepy doing this in survival mode, though. I'm so used to doing this in creative for the seed showcase, but uh, we're doing it in survival. It's a little, little creepy, not gonna lie, it's just a little bit. Found a library, let's go. Okay, okay. Oh my god, you are joking. Three enchanted books. Three enchanted books in one stronghold chest? How? Looting two? Oh my god. That is insane. If I put that on my diamond sword right now and we find Enderman, I could get like two or three pearls from each kill. Projectile protection four and quick charge two. Quick charge two would be nice on that crossbow. Let's see the last one. Come on, baby. Give me mending. You know you want to give me mending. Do it. Looting two. Looting three. Looting the. It duplicated two looting two books. Oh my. Oh my god. This is like. This is just phenomenal. The kind of luck we're getting right now. This is crazy. 
Bro. I, I'm like... I'm just, I'm astonished. Here it is. Here's the way up. Bro. Okay, I see the chest. It's right here. Alright. Let's see. Do we get mending? I'm really hoping we get mending. Okay, there's an enchanted book. What's this? Unknown map? Unknown map? I've never seen that. I've seen treasure maps. I've never seen an unknown. Oh, man. Luck of the Sea th 2 and Piercing 3. I'll, I'll take the Luck of the Sea. I'll take that. And by the way, there's water up here. How is there water up there? I, I'm tempted to break it, but I, I want to keep exploring down here. This is crazy. This is awesome. This is awesome. I love this. I love this so much right now. And actually, I need to get this coal. For once in my life, I'm actually saying I need coal. So I'll just go ahead and grab that real quick. Okay. All right. Let's go. Uh... You know, there's a ton of this we have to explore still. Like, I mean, there is a a ton that I have not explored yet. And by the way, is this... Is this like a continuation of this stronghold? Like, should I break this gravel and check back there? I don't know. I feel like it looks like it spawned too, too unnaturally for that. Damn it. Oh, uh, I really, like, my hopes were up high on that one. I was like, maybe there's an ender brawl in here. <laughs> There wasn't, but it's okay. I would love this stream. By the way, I think we just found a second library, which is awesome. Oh, wow. Huh. Feather Falling 4. That is amazing. That's I've been wanting Feather Falling. I've needed Feather Falling 4 for a while. It's like my favorite enchantment for boots in this game. Because fall damage is just so lethal in this game. Let's see what this bad boy's got to offer. Give me mending, baby. You know you want to. By the way, the fact that every chest has had at least one or more enchanted books now is just crazy. Eh, knockback 2, I'll take it. I'll take it, I'll, ta I'll take it, I'll take the knockback 2, I'll take it. It's like the game knows that this is like my first time fighting the dragon solo, and it's just trying to freaking get me all ready for it. Which I appreciate, game. Thank you for that. Much appreciate. Oh, here it is! It was right here the whole time! <gasps> what? It spawned with three eyes? Bro. <laughs> Bro, no way. Bro, come on. Game. Game. Wait, what? what's killing me? Oh, it's this thing. Alright, my little... My little excitement streak ended right there. Thanks to that silverfish. But seriously, though, this game... Bro, get out of the way so I can destroy your freaking nest. Okay. This game, this game loves me right now. I mean, actually. Like, <laughs> this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. A freaking three-eyed frame. Crazy. I don't think it spawns like that ever. I think it's very rare for it to spawn with three eyes. So, very good news for us. Let's go ahead and set up shop real quick because... Actually, here, I'm going to go grab those chests real quick. Alright, we got ourselves a chest, and we are going to put this bad boy right there. Okay, what do we store away? I guess we'll put the pumpkin in there, because that... Well, actually, no, let me let me quickly... Let me quickly... How do I make a freaking... Oh, I need shears. Son of a... Okay. Well... I think this is... I, I have no idea if this is how you do it. Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, and I got pumpkin seeds for that. Dope. Alright, so we got our uh, mask, <laughs> our pumpkin mask, we got that ready to go, which is awesome, and I think I think we're good right now. All we really gotta do is just take this stuff back to the, uh, to the, to the spawn island, and I think we'll be good to go. Alright, let's go ahead and put the Eye of Enders in real quick, though. Just like that. Okay, we need one, two, three, four, five. We need five more. Five more eye vendors. And then we will be ready to fight the dragon. So hopefully we can do that this episode. I'm hoping by the end of this episode we'll have all the eye vendors we need. And we'll have the portal fully open, ready to go. And then next episode we'll either just jump right into the ender dragon fight. Or we'll prepare a little bit and then fight the dragon. But hopefully... We can get that done within the next two episodes. Okay, alright, I think we're good. Alright, let's get out of here, and, um, yeah, yeah, let's just get the hell out of here. Which, 
Actually, how do we get out of here? There's no way I'm leaving the way I came in, because I freaking don't even remember how I got in. Maybe I should just dig a new way out. Do you think I should? Yeah, let's just let's just dig a new way out, because I don't really feel like... Yeah, I don't really feel like finding the way back out. Oh! Crap! Alright, we dug into water, which... Actually, to be honest, that might be good. As long as I don't drown. As long as I do not drown. Or get blown up by this creeper. Wait a minute, is this where we entered? This is where we entered, isn't it? Yeah, this is right where we entered. <laughs> wow! That's crazy. It was right under here this whole time. That's awesome. Okay, so the good news is, I think I do remember exactly how to get back home. And I think I know where the boat is as well. So, yeah. I am going to cut this part out. Unless I find an Enderman on the way back. And, uh, yeah, I'll meet you guys back at Spawn Island. Let's go. All right, we are back. Awesome. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm quickly going to go clear out my inventory a little bit because, damn, we have a full freaking inventory. We found so much stuff. We found so much stuff. It's unbelievable how much we found in there. So let's go ahead and just deposit some of this stuff. Uh, actually, we'll put that away. And we are going to definitely need to get a uh, enchantment table all ready to go we're gonna need to get an anvil we gotta get all kinds of stuff and i need to put this somewhere else oh wait no actually i can just break that there we go all right fortune book goes in there look at c moving twos knockbacks all that stuff put that away that away and we'll just put it all away all right uh let's see i guess we could put it We'll probably put it down here, I guess. Yeah, we'll put it right there. Just for now. Okay, so. Got the anvil all ready to go. And what we're going to do now is let me get out these looting twos real quick. We're going to go ahead and combine these like so. Because we need a looting, t looting three sword so bad. So we're going to go ahead and do that. We're actually going to get our diamonds out. We're going to craft... If I can get some wood. Okay, I think we need books. We need books, don't we? Yeah, we need books. Nice! Alright, so let's go ahead and get this enchantment table. And our diamond sword. Hell yeah. And we actually have a diamond left over still. Awesome. Ah, oh, you know I love to see that. Okay. As much as I want to use the diamond pick for the first 30 levels of enchanting, I think, I think we need to use the sword. Because whatever enchantment that the table gives us for the sword, we can still put looting three on it. Even when it's, you know, enchanted with the table. So I think that'd be the smartest route as much as I want a good pickaxe. We don't really need it that bad. We need a good sword though. So let's go ahead and do that. Now to do that though, we are going to need a crap ton of bookshelves. Which actually makes me really regret not grabbing a ton while we were at the at the the stronghold. Crap. Okay. New change of plans. Uh, what we're gonna do, and this this could be interesting for sure, but what we're gonna do, we're gonna pick up that, and I think we need to head back to the stronghold again. And. I'm actually annoyed with myself. We came here practically for nothing. Because I don't have enough in materials to make bookshelves. And uh, the best way to do it would just be to go back to the stronghold and take all their bookshelves. <laughs> uh, damn it. I'm an idiot. Okay. Oh, it's really, really... Alright, so real quick, while I'm thinking of it, uh, I'm going to put this peony... Actually, is that how you say it? Peony, I, I'm not sure if I'm, if I'm saying that right, but I'm going to put this right here in the center of this island. And uh, this is to commemorate one of my subscribers, uh, Lost Ones, so uh, apologies for that, dude. Seriously. Um, I hope you feel better, man. For real. So, that's going to go right there. All for you, my guy. And also, I think I may have found a good way to actually get back to the end stronghold and also have a permanent way back and forth. But it could be kind of dangerous. Um, I'm sure you probably know where this is going. But, um... The nether portal. I'm thinking we should just enter the nether portal. 
and try to... I know there's something up with the nether. I think it's like 75% less of the blocks you travel to get to each destination. I think it's like... I think the nether's way faster travel than the overworld. I'm pretty sure that's a thing. So I'm thinking we just go into the nether. We build a pathway leading to the coordinates that we're trying to get to to the stronghold. And then we kind of just go in, enter the, uh, make a new end portal. I mean, a uh, nether portal. So I think that's what we're going to do. Now, only thing is, do we have enough obsidian? Ooh, yikes. I, do we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We do. We have exactly enough. Perfect. All right, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to go into the nether. I do remember the stronghold coordinates. It's 4,000, 1,000, pretty much. That's where the portal is. So that's where we're going to try to get to in the nether. I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to gauge it. If I don't think it tells you the exact coordinates that you're trying to get to in the nether. So probably just going just gonna to have to like guess, I guess. So yeah, you probably have no idea what I'm talking about. Because even I don't really know what I'm talking about. But just trust me, this should work, theoretically. Can't see. Okay. All right, is there anything here trying to kill me? All right, looks good coast is clear I think all right so here's what we need to do since since every block you travel in the nether I think counts as like two blocks or like three blocks we are going to head to okay all right <laughs> sorry I'm trying to I'm trying to word this correctly so I don't confuse anyone basically we're going to head positive 2,000 blocks, so by the time we get where we're going, we should be at X coordinate 2,000, and the Z coordinate should be 500. That's what we're doing, so we're just going to go, I guess. All right, here we are. This is it. Right here. This platform actually will be perfect for where we're going to build this. Let's build this freaking portal. And I, I think the best thing about this, if I can speak, is I don't think we have to worry about any ghasts. This is literally perfect. All right, let's go ahead and build this freaking sucker. All right. It's all framed and ready to go. We just got to light it. And presto. All right, I think we're just about at the perfect coordinates to get somewhere inside that mine shaft or even in the stronghold. I think this should be perfect. Okay. Oh my Jesus Christ. Huh. Man, my Xbox did not like this teleportation. Well, uh... The good news is I was right. It definitely takes me a lot further than I thought. Bad news is we're about... a little over 11,000 blocks away from our destination. Fuck.